Hello everybody, it's Ben Dominator and welcome back to another video. Now, Epic Games made a huge mistake when releasing the 17.40 update. We're going to talk about it in today's video. Before we get started, if you guys actually do end up enjoying this video, be sure to give this video a like, subscribe if you are new because I make videos like this all the time, and you can also use my supporter creator code BENDOMINATOR in the item shop hashtag ad. Let's go ahead and get right into the video. So if you recall yesterday, I made a video talking about a ton of leaked stuff that came to the game and I ended up having to make another video because a lot of the skins that were actually encrypted got revealed. And this isn't because leakers just magically found out a way to get better at decrypting files. No, it's actually because Epic did not encrypt these files correctly, and that goes for pretty much all the encrypted files that were actually added in the update. So that means like skin leaks, encrypted strings, and even event files. And don't worry, I'm not gonna be spoiling any event stuff in this video. In fact, I don't know like anything about it, but I do know that there will be an event and that it got leaked. Whether the event is for this season or next season, I have no idea, but it did get leaked. So if you really want to find spoilers for it, I'm sure you will be able to find them somewhere on the internet. A Twitter account by the name of DefaultBR tweeted, Sadly, major event spoils slipped through, and it's accessible by almost everyone. I won't be posting it, just be aware that they do exist, and some people did post them already. If you don't want to see them, make sure you are following the correct people. So yeah, it's kind of crazy how Epic Games actually failed to encrypt a lot of these files and a lot of things end up slipping through the cracks. That is why I was able to cover all these encrypted skins in yesterday's video because they weren't encrypted correctly. Normally leakers wouldn't be able to actually see these skins in game unless they were decrypting it through a console version. And ever since this was discovered, Hypex has been posting a bunch of leaks that we previously wouldn't have known about if it weren't for the fact that many of these files actually failed to be encrypted properly. So there are actually a bunch of potential spoilers ahead for upcoming cosmetics and even season 8. So I would recommend that if you don't want to be spoiled, leave this video now. But if you don't mind spoilers, I'm going to be full diving into a lot of the very interesting things that Hypex actually said. So yeah, major spoilers ahead. Let's get into it. I'm going to be starting with the most interesting thing first, and this is about season 8. Hypex says that we might get a mummy skin in Season 8, but it could be scrapped. It matches with the theme of a POI coming in Season 8. The POIs slash landmarks are Pyramid, Cubes, and Crash Site. He says there's most likely more, but these are the only ones that got leaked. So yeah, maybe a potential Egyptian theme in Season 8? I guess we'll just have to wait and see. We also got a few tweets relating to even more cosmetics. He says that there's going to be an upcoming Shadow Legends 2, possibly for Season 8, 9, or X, with Shadow Dream, Shadow Kuno, and Shadow Kenji. And yeah, that does seem very, very possible, especially with the Kuno in there. They really like to reskin the Kuno skin a lot, I have noticed. And the last super interesting thing here that I found is that he made a tweet saying some names slash codenames of upcoming skins from the survey. I might be wrong about the last one. Dark Drift. Kevin Koshur, Cyber Runner, and Hacker. And I apologize if I butchered the name for the cube skin. And yeah, more skins from the survey. These aren't my favorite skins from the survey for sure, but they are some pretty cool skins. So yeah, that's about all I'm going to cover in today's video, but feel free to go check out Hypex on Twitter to see a lot more crazy stuff. He reveals a bunch more strings about mostly upcoming cosmetics and stuff like that. But yeah, Epic Games did really make a big mistake with this update. They left a lot of things open to the point where even the event is up in the air. Luckily, I haven't seen any spoilers yet, but it is very possible and very likely, so be sure to stay safe from being spoiled from this event and possible other things that may have come from this leak as well. Of course, Hypex is mostly just leaking links related to strings of the files and not actual files of themselves, so you should be safe checking out his stuff, but beware of other more unknown leakers that may have access to the stuff because apparently it is very, very easy to actually get access to. But yeah, pretty crazy that we just got a bunch of cool information 
That may or may not end up actually becoming true, but it does seem pretty likely in the long run. Again, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys liked it, be sure to give a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new, because I make videos like this all the time, and you can use my supporter creator code BENDOMINATOR in the Fortnite item shop, hashtag ad. Have a great rest of your day, and goodbye.